again and welcome back to our course on Excel for Mac 2019. In this module we're going to continue talking about formulas and I want to speak to you a little bit about the order of operators because again this is a really important concept to get your head around. Now unfortunately I am going to have to take you back to school a little bit in this module and start out by speaking to you about something called bod mass. And you can see I've got it listed out across my spreadsheet. And this may be something that you remember from school. I certainly do. I remember the teacher writing this up on the chalkboard, which gives you an idea of my age. We were still using chalkboards. And these operators are used to determine the order in which the formula is calculated. So you can see here we have brackets, over, division, multiplication, addition, subtraction. And you can see underneath I have the symbols that you use in Excel if you want to use one of those in a calculation. So what this essentially means is that Excel will calculate anything that you put within brackets first. It will then do any divisions, then multiplications, then additions, and finally it will do subtractions. So why does this matter? I'm going to show you a very, very simple example. If I was to type into this cell equals 10 plus 6 divided by 2. Now, in my mind, the answer I'm looking for here is 8. I wanted to do 10 plus 6, which will be 16, and then I want it to divide by 2, which will give me 8. If I press enter, however, Excel gives me an answer of 13. But why is it doing that? Well, if we go back and take a look at that formula, what Excel is actually doing is 10 plus 6 divided by 2. So it's doing the division first. So if you look up into that table, you can see divisions are done before additions. So essentially, it's doing 6 divided by 2, which gives us 3, and then it's adding the 10. And that is why we have a total of 13, and not the total I was hoping for, which was 8. So how do we get around this? Well, we refer to bod mass. So what I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to put brackets around what I want it to calculate first. So I want it to do 10 plus 6 first and then I want it to divide by 2. And there we go, I get my answer of 8. So this is a really important rule to be aware of when you're constructing calculations. If you do get something that you weren't expecting, it might be because you have your formula and your operators in the wrong order. Now, you might think, well, God, that sounds quite complicated to think about every time I'm writing a formula. You will find as you use Excel, it just kind of becomes second nature to you. You kind of always start out with your brackets and then you do everything afterwards. But as with anything, this does take a little bit of practice. So remember the bod mass rule when you're doing calculations. Please join me in the next module where we're going to talk about working with ranges. Thanks for watching. If you're not a subscriber, click below to subscribe so you get notified about similar videos we upload. And click over there to get the complete Excel for Mac 2019 beginners course. And click over there to watch the complete set of Excel Mac videos in this playlist.